The group is comprised of uh, a variety of stakeholders. So we had elementary, middle school, high school, both teachers, support staff, administrators, as well as parents and other stakeholders. So it was a wide, uh, versed group. That was the first thing. And second, our, our charge was to take a look at what the state of uh, uh, students and their experiences, instruction, and all of that amalgamated together, and then vision cast what we would like it to be, and then look at the pathways and resources and potential um, goal setting that we could have for the future. And so that was our charge. And I, I really enjoyed the process because it brought to bear uh, not only the stakeholders, which had rich experiences and perspectives, but it also brought a lot of resources that we collaboratively looked at together. And yes, there was a lot of common sense to it, but it also uh, mostly reinforced a lot of presuppositions that, yes, we're doing a great job here at Kettering, but there's some work to do. And I think everybody knew that, but it was, it was, um, it was very, very fulfilling to go through that process that with quality people and then having some outcomes that we think can happen here at Kettering. Um, not a bunch, but there were a few small uh, things. One in particular was that uh, collaboration while all groups that we surveyed, when we survey data and some uh, research-based processes to kind of gather that and review that, um, but in that survey data, there were some discrepancies between um, parents, students, and staff, and particularly around collaboration and what that looks like and how that should be, uh, how students should experience that and the rigor and the outcomes and the roles and responsibilities and the accountability. And so we spent some time talking through that because that's part of the 21st century experience for students, both uh, we know post-secondary in the professional world as well as during um, their schooling. And so we knew that was an important aspect and piece. And we spent a lot of time on those differences and why they were differences and then what to do about those and how to bridge those gaps. Well, I think efficacy is the word you're going to hear from us, and that collaboration is integrated all throughout our findings, our recommendations. Um, first of all, Kettering's doing great. Uh, there's data to support that. There's um, some belief and presuppositions that we believe that, and that is uh, meshed together. That's integrated together. So that's the positive. Going forward, I think the biggest part of this is coming from the research and the data and the recommendations is that the, um, the school system has some work to do, particularly in collaboration, intentional collaboration, both from staff, community stakeholders, and students. And beyond that, 21st century skills integrated into collaborative uh, experiences that are predominantly student-led, inquiry-based, and rigorous with accountability and that have applications to the real world. I think that was the big takeaway. Uh, throughout all the data from a variety of different sources, that was borne out. And so we were excited about that because that's the direction we're already headed in a variety of different levels. Um, and project-based learning uh, was a big part of that as well. So that was encouraging because we're already moving in that direction and have been doing that and got tons of uh, experiences and current practices that we could um, lean upon and glean.